Hello there and welcome. I am going to be talking you through how to get rid of those nasty flukes and internal parasites in your lovely fish. The two products which I recommend highly are Fluke Solve and Kasuri Fluke M. Now, what is the difference between these two products? Because essentially they do very, very similar things. Well, both of them have been designed. Does it look like? Both of them have been designed to treat ponds, so they are extremely strong. 100 grams treats 25,000 litres, 65 grams treats 5,500 gallons, which is a tonne of litres. So you get value for money in an aquarium. What do they do? Well, both of them are extremely good against killing flukes and parasites and internal worms and stuff like that in your fish. Anything which is hanging on to your fish's skin or gills is going to be eradicated by this and also any of those nasty internal parasites which make your fish get thin and poop out that white stringy poo, this will kill them. Both of them work in a similar way, they get absorbed by the fish's body and will then basically as far as I understand it, dissolve the internal digestive tract of the parasite. The parasite will starve and then it will die and be pooped out or absorbed by the fish. Lovely stuff. Both of these products can be used in cold water, fresh water, pond or salt water aquariums, but they are obviously not reef safe. So only use these in a quarantine tank or a fish only aquarium. Neither of them harm your good beneficial bacteria in your aquarium, so don't worry about that. But it is recommended you turn off your protein skimmers, your UV lights, and try to dose this at night time because I believe it gets broken down by light. But I'm not 100% sure on that. So which one do you want to choose? Well, for a freshwater aquarium, there isn't really much in it. I prefer to use the Prezi Quantrol because it dissolves easier in water. For salt water, however, you're probably more likely to use the Fluke M. The reason being is it is mixed with a naturally sourced calcium carbonate. That will actually buffer your aquarium water, keeping your carbonate hardness high, which can be beneficial in a saltwater aquarium. Either way, both of these work extremely well to eradicate flukes and to eradicate any internal parasites. Many aquarium users don't use this stuff because they don't know it exists. However, here I am recommending them to you. You get your value for money and they are really, really good. One tip I would like to give you though, if you are going to be dosing Fluke M, um, you can do a pre-course of chloramine T. And what that will do is soften up the fish's membrane, mucous membrane that is, and allow the Fluke M to absorb into the body a lot easier. Sometimes if the mucous membrane is too thick, it will actually shield the parasite. Using the chloramine T, chloramine T beforehand will break this down a little bit and help the Fluke M to work properly. So, here are your Fluke problems solved. Woo! And thank you for watching. If you like my video, subscribe and like it. And happy fish keeping!